A while back, I was riding my Barracuda when the left pedal started getting a little crunchy. Eventually, it seized up completely and worked its way out of the crank arm. I was able to rebuild the pedal, but the threads on the crank arm were a little damaged from the incident. I decided I wanted to make a thread chasing tool using an old pedal, kind of following RJ the Bike Guy's idea of a crank extractor thread chasing tool. My local bike shop was nice enough to give me a junk pedal they had laying around. Uh, note that it does need to be a left pedal to repair left hand threads and a right pedal to repair right hand threads. I took the pedal apart just so I could get the spindle out and then I took it to the shop where I store my pedicab to use the vise there because I don't have a good vise at my home right now. I first put a piece of tape with an X drawn with marker on it just so I could uh, see where to make the cuts with my Dremel tool. I thought that would be easier on my eyes in that poorly lit shop. The idea is to make cuts that will give the metal shavings and debris a place to go as you clean up the threads. A pedal with a hollowed out spindle that would accept an allen key would go a little quicker than this solid steel spindle did, but it only took a few minutes with the Dremel tool. It didn't come out perfect, but I don't think that should affect how the tool works. First, we'll add some oil, and then begin threading in the tool. Again, it's a left pedal, so it threads in counterclockwise. We thread it in, and then we back it out a bit. Then we thread it in, and back it out a little bit. I did end up scratching the crank arm with my wrench. That was my own fault. It had nothing to do with the thread chaser tool. I'm not sure if you can tell on camera, but the threads do look better. They were mostly damaged uh, by the outside of them, which makes sense if you think about a pedal working its way out of the threads with a foot still applying force to it. Then we just clean it out and reinstall the pedal, and now I have a functional mountain bike again, just in time for winter. We just had our first real snow here in Milwaukee, so it's Barracuda season for me. So there it is, an easy DIY pedal thread chasing tool. Uh, this tool worked for me in this instance. I haven't tried it on any severely stripped threads yet, so I can't guarantee it'll work in every situation, but maybe it'll help. Thank you for watching.